Hello and welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm. So there was a bonus episode. Surprise! This takes place in a time before the events of Life is Strange 1 and also this when Chloe and Max are kids. Um, so it's like an extra special little farewell to, I guess, the universe. I guess this is probably it. Probably not getting any more. But we'll see, I guess. Uh, is that dynamite? <laughs> Ready? I guess. But isn't your mom going to freak? She's probably cooking with the radio on. She won't hear a thing. I bet she'll notice a hole in the floor. Trust in science, Max. Even when science means blowing shit up. Oh my god. Oh my god. My controller is vibrating. I forgot that's plugged in. Oh shit, my life. What are we doing? Oh no. Oh! Wow. <laughs> Tell me that wasn't the coolest thing you've ever seen! You're insane. No, that was that was quite amazing. That was truly amazing. Why are explosions so awesome? That's like asking why are puppies cute? Some things just are. Um, I'm not sure your mom would see it that way. When she asked me to get rid of my old junk, she never specified how. But I guess I better do some actual cleaning too. Yeah, girl. I'll be excavating the closet. If you see anything else to trash, help a girl out and chuck it on the pile over there. Okay. It feels like I've spent half my life hanging out in this room. <laughs> Probably because I have. I can't believe those days are all over. Shit, is she moving away? Is that the events that happen here? In a few days, my whole family moves to Seattle. I have no idea when I'll see Chloe again. This could be my last chance to say goodbye. But how do you tell your best friend that you're leaving her? You haven't told her yet. Like, you've got, what, a few days warning? What the fuck? That's just badly timed. Surely you get it out of the way like a month before. If you can. Just to, you know, prepare yourselves. I better help Chloe with her cleaning. And while I'm at it, I can take one long last look around this place. Alright. As usual, Chloe's grades are better than mine. I still kick her butt in PE though. Pay a okay. Ugh. That was awesome. Who else but Chloe could turn cleaning her room into a pyrotechnical adventure? Mr. Sharky. Oh my god. Uh. Uh. Oh no. Existential crisis alert. Um. I think Chloe used to call this guy Mr. Sharky. I doubt she plays with it anymore. Do I trash Mr. Sharky? I mean, it says trash. Like, uh, uh, I'll come back to you. Oh, God. People say a lot of things about the Prescott family, but this is pretty cool. Cool. Okay. I bet Chloe's oh. parents were freaking out when she got this letter. Oh, yeah, the letter to say you've been accepted to Blackwell, yeah. I still can't believe you're a Blackwell Academy student. How is it? Oh, the classes are incredible. The teachers are actually smart. And the lab is legit. Petri dishes for days. What about the students? Are they as stuck up as you thought they'd be? They're fine. 
Uh, no. Also, mm. also, this is what she was like before her dad died. Like, look at the potential. It's lost. She could have been a scientist. She likes the lab. Chloe, you are terrible at hiding your feelings. Is everything okay? I don't know. I just, I like hanging out with normal people. Like you. Thanks. I guess. You know what I mean. I, I hate fake people. You're real. Thanks. Okay. Right. Uh, next. Oh, yes. Hey, what's your dad's camera doing in here? Dad said I could bring it up here for you to use. He's tired of watching you drool all over yourself every time he uses it. His words. Your dad is the best. Sure. Just don't ever tell him that. We need to keep him on his toes. Aha! <laughs> You're off to a great start. Actually, it's kind of cool. Okay. Well, that's cool. That's how she gets the camera. What's in here? Oh. I was lucky to survive Chloe's magic phase with all my fingers intact. Let's trash that. This seems like a good candidate. Are you insane? That's my entire magic collection. Do you know how many weeks of allowance this cost? You never use it, though. You haven't touched these since the fifth grade talent show. Maybe because my assistant turned out to be squeamish at the sight of fake blood. At least you didn't saw me in half. How are you planning to clean this place if you won't throw away anything? A magician never reveals her secrets. Put it back. Oh, no. This is it now. This is what it's going to be, isn't it? It's not going to be getting rid of anything at all. It's going to be arguments about shit and then they're tied to memories and we're going to get all sentimental. You better not be thinking what I think you are. <laughs> Chloe, I haven't seen you touch this guy in years. Why do you care? Why do I care if you throw my beloved childhood friend into the trash? I don't think that deserves an answer. <laughs> Sorry, chum. That's better. Okay. So, uh, high chart. Chloe's been beating me for a while, but that growth spurt could come any day now. <laughs> or not. It's gonna happen. We end up short. Although your face fills out a bit more, which is weird at the moment. Uh, okay. Sure. What about this half eaten jawbreaker? A serious biohazard. You promised me we'd finish it together no matter how long it took. Don't be a quitter. Yo. Your mom and your dentist will thank me. <laughs> so lame. Just so lame. <laughs> I like sussy, angry Chloe. I'm just going to throw more okay. shit away. Whenever I'm ready, I can go tell Chloe I'm done arguing about trash with her. Nope. Chloe's such a nerd. She hangs on to all her old textbooks and school supplies. Chloe keeps trying to get me to hop on her board. I'd rather take pictures. That's fair. What? They're going in the trash. <laughs> How about these boy band trading cards? Uh, what? Super cringeworthy. Yeah, and hilarious. Remember when we gave them all makeovers? Uh, Sharpie, no, they're still funny. You mean when you drew boobs on all of them? I was so mad at you. And yet, our friendship lived on. So too will these cards. Oh, no. Fine. You can put them on Instagram later, can't you? Like those fucking googly-eyed Pokemon ones that we all thought were amazing. 
This doll hat. Why can't we chuck this? Live fast, die young, and go out with a bang. <laughs> Rest in pieces, doll. Chloe's had this hung up on her wall forever, but neither of us can figure out what happened to the last panel. Oh. I hope Dr. Chloenstein's okay. Well, who knows? Guess we'll never find out. Chloe's always preferred imaginary animals to real ones. Well, besides Bongo, of course. Chloe's mom wanted us to go through this pile of old clothes and find stuff to donate. Instead, we played dress up for an hour. Wow. Brilliant. Great job. This was our first unsupervised concert together. It was so much fun. We were supposed to see another show next month, but... How sick was that show? The sickest. I've been working on my moves for the next one. Check it out. <laughs> How about you? Any new moves? Uh, totally. Yeah, totally. I've been working on my air guitar. <laughs> Damn, Caulfield. Save something for when it counts. <laughs> All right. Back to the junk mines. The junk mines. Jeez. Okay. Uh, glowy bear. Let this box of trash be a sacrifice to you, oh almighty glowy bear. Oopsies. What are you doing? Adding this to the pile. No freaking way. Just because I beat your ass every time we play doesn't make it trash. We, we never play. Chloe, we haven't played this game in years. And it's missing half the pieces. <laughs> nice try, Max. But you can't erase your shame that easily. Oh... <laughs> oh okay i think i've got everything there now so oh hoodie chloe's had this hoodie for years it's her favorite i don't think she'd mean to throw it away Shh, don't tell anyone what are you doing your favorite hoodie you must have thrown it in by mistake right no it, it, it's fine it's filled with holes and falling apart. That never stopped you from wearing it before. It's fine. Really. Okay. O okay. Weird. That's it. I'm calling off the search. If you want more trash, you'll have to find it yourself. Well, it wasn't exactly the purge mom was hoping for, but at least we tried, right? Right. And now we've got the whole day ahead of us. What do two undersupervised friends with clean rooms and clean slates want to get into today? I guess now would be a good time to tell Chloe I'm leaving. Or I could let us enjoy the day first and tell her later. Oh, God. Um... No, I should tell her now, shouldn't I? After after all, I did like go. Uh, why the fuck haven't you told her already? I'm telling her now. Actually, Chloe, I really have to tell you something. It's I don't know how Holy to. Shit! Oh. Max, hold that thought. This must have fallen out when I was digging around in here. Do you have any idea what this is? Uh, it's it's pirate related. Whatever it is, it looks like it came out of our pirate phase. Your powers of deduction are as strong as ever. This tape is from five years ago. It's a message from our past selves to our current selves. So we were eight years old? That's crazy. I can't even imagine what we sounded like. Oh my god, retro tape recorders! Ready to find out. <laughs> A vast future wayfarer! Ye have 
have uncovered the audio log of the most fearsome pirates in the bays of Arcadia. <laughs> <laughs> Captain, Captain Bluebeard and Long <laughs> Silver. You are such so, you're in search of buried treasure, are ye? Well, <laughs> if it's treasure ye seek, be mine eyes. <laughs> what? Dad, get away! We're in the middle of an important project. Oh, a project? Never mind then. I apologize. I mean it. All right, all right. Supper's in five. Wash your hands, you grubby pirate kids. <laughs> so lame. <laughs> As I was saying, <laughs> if it's treasure you seek, you've come to the right place. But be forewarned: the journey will be treacherous and full of. <laughs> Treasures. Nice. To find the treasure of Price Isle, you will need the map from the manuscripts of Captain Bluebeard. Only the map can lead ye to the treasure ye seek. But be forewarned. Uh, again, only those <laughs> pure hearts will be able to see what the amulet shows them. The amulet. <laughs> Good luck. And... Uh, <laughs> Dude, that was uh darky. It was quite dorky. I don't know. It was all three. Um, amazing. Amazing. I can't believe you still have that. Uh, I would never throw away something so <laughs> precious. Okay. Okay. Forget everything. Today. We go treasure hunting. Oh god, really? What for that? I think I know what eight-year-old you meant by the manuscripts of Captain Bluebeard. Our old sketchbook. This is where we kept all our pirate drawings. Yep. Now let's see this map. Okay. This was kind of awesome. So, property of Captain Bluebeard and Long Max Silver. Keep out, Mom. Four kids. Uh, the Bane of Arcadia, which is their ship. Long Max Silver and Bluebeard. Pogo the Pirate. Nice. Nice. Nice picture here. Excellent. Uh, these are the pirate rules. No bathing. No boys on the ship. No sharing pirate secrets. Always share plunder. Always bury treasure. Always protect fellow pirates. Failure to obey these rules will result in plank walking. Oh my god. Another day of plunder and destruction on the high seas. Our just buried treasure has come under attack again. The evil commander Shelley, enemy to all pirates, has threatened to take the map from us if she sees it. Teacher? Surely she has heard how valuable our treasure is and wants to steal it from us. We are doing our best to keep the map hidden as we continue to work on it. Because our enemies want our treasure so bad, we must make sure the map is only readable to us, Captain Bluebeard and Long Max Silver. To more plunder and riches. This looks like a page was oh. ripped out. I wonder if it's the map. Well, I guess so. Hey, check this out. This page was ripped out. Do you think it's the map? If it is, there's no way I would have thrown it out. Maybe it's mixed in with the rest of the drawings? So much for telling Chloe now. <laughs> well, she can Oh, no, that's just going back to the book. Oops, and I've interrupted it. Whoops. Chloe and I were doing a lot of drawing in Miss Shelley's class. I wonder if the map is mixed in with her school supplies from that year. Possibly... Ah. Ah. Bingo. Right. Oh my god. So Chloe's secret lair to the dark cavern. We will find an amulet. To Treasure Island to Price Castle. Or all that way. Actually, maybe. Yeah, that would make more sense. Oh, I don't know. Either way, whatever. I'm remembering this now. 
didn't we make some crazy puzzle? You need the telescope and the amulet, which we hid inside a dark cavern, AKA the attic. Ugh, why did we do that to ourselves? Because we were eight years old and the attic was the scariest place we could think of. Still scary, still there. Ah. You think it's still there? Should be, as long as the clean police haven't gotten to it first. Okay, and once we have the amulet and the telescope, we use them to reveal the treasure. Somehow. Here's what's happening. I'll head to the garage to dig up my old telescope. You go find that amulet. We'll meet out back at the pirate ship. You mean the swings? Yes, the pirate ship. Captain Bluebeard and Long Max Silver right again, bitches! I'll find a way to tell Chloe later. If this has to be my last day here, might as well have one final pirate adventure. Okay, Chloe said she hid the amulet in the attic. The only way in is through the broom closet. Okay. There it is, the dark cavern. Oh God. Crap, I can't get into the attic if I can't even reach the door. I need to find something to stand on. I'm sure I can find something around here to boost me up. Try the crate. Just fucking jump it. God damn, girl. Oh my god. This girl. It seems like Chloe's dad always has a project around the house. Oh. Oh. I, what? This has changed. Hasn't it? Or was it always this big? I'm confused. Why am I going in here? The things inside this cabinet haven't changed very much over the years. Sorry, I should be just, like, looking through people's stuff. Jesus fucking Christ. Um. Hmm. Just go in here, yeah. Oh, yes. Almost there. I just need a few more inches. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Okay. Oh, loose post. I don't really want to like nose about in this stuff. Jesus Christ. Oh. The principal at Blackwell wants to meet with Chloe's parents. I wonder what about. Incident last week. I'm concerned about her behavior. Did Chloe get into a fight? She never gets in trouble. I'm glad her dad stood up for her. Voicemail? I wonder if it's still there. Sometimes I really wish I had siblings. Oh, that's about, that's just between the prices, but yeah, that's like Chloe done something. So went down. Chloe hasn't mentioned a trip. Maybe it's supposed to be a surprise. Wow, oh, so cool. Chloe is such a nature Ooh. nerd. I bet she's gonna love it. Nice. Chloe's parents are so cute. Aww. Uh, we don't need to look at this stuff. Well, we do. I, I want to go through everything, but at the same time, like, I don't want to know that much. Also, I want to find the treasure. Oh, steady. I think that should be tall enough. Oh my god, we're going to die. Or not. Holy shit. Awesome. 
where's the light switch? Oh, thank God. Man, there is a ton of stuff up here. How will I ever... Oh. There it is. Of course Chloe hid the amulet in the hardest place to get to. Oh. I need to find a way through. But first... Oh, the amulet's got a little map in it. I see. I think I can squeeze through now. This is fucking mental. A little bit, just slightly. Oh, I don't like this. It's just very atmospheric. And I'm like, I, actually, I should be saying something. But no, instead I'm just going, oh, oh, shit. It's a good thing I'm big and burly. Otherwise, moving this furniture would be kind of difficult. Uh, pull? Sure. Keep it moving, Jack. Oh, steady. Oh. Crap. Bollocks, okay. Uh, try that. One step closer. Okay. Can we get through? I don't know, maybe not. Uh, can we push? Which side does she mean? Oh, she means that way. Oh, girl. This desk's pretty heavy. Oh, that does work. Okay. Now I just need to push the, the old-timey cola out the way. He shouldn't keep this up here. If it's like a proper... If it's a Coke one, because there were loads of those. I watched American Salvage... Or, no, American Restoration recently, and there's loads of these fuckers. Glad this thing is empty. Get it restored. Sell it, mate. It'll be sorted. We'll just sell it. it looks pretty good. Again? Oh, that way. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Oh, good. <laughs> it's spooky anyway. Lovely. Just what I wanted. Pretty good nick up here, considering. Just appropriate spider webs in random places, not all over the place. Finally. There we go. Got you. This thing is cool, I guess. I wish I could remember how it works. Oh. 